Hello, hello, hello. This is a message from the universe for 8 21 2020. This is the rune Suelu. Suelu is the rune of wholeness, it is the life force. This rune is all about reconciling all the pieces of you, embracing all of those spaces, looking closely at yourself, and integrating all the pieces with your divine connection. Often in our human life, we lock things away for our own protection. We shut down our vulnerability so that others can't hurt us. But those things that we shut away are often the things that will most help us. If you've noticed in your life, you may be very frustrated by shutdown after shutdown, delay after delay, not just in the world around you, but within yourself. When things are moving forward, they kind of feel like, why are we just sitting here? Why aren't we moving forward? I feel like I've done all of my work. You have to look very closely at the burdens that you carry from your past hurts, at those spaces in you that you have locked away so that you are not vulnerable to being hurt. Because the integration process, the process of embracing your spiritual connection with the universe and the universe that is already within you, that divine essence that is always with you, it needs those pieces that you've locked away. It needs those vulnerable spaces, those soft spots, that loving, caring, nurturing energy that may have allowed you to be hurt in the past, but they are necessary because the energy of the universe is love, is unconditional love. And if you are protecting yourself from that love, then you are blocking part of the energy of the universe. So it is time for you to do a little self-care, to do a little self-healing, to look very closely at those spaces within yourself and to become vulnerable. You notice that she is fully nude. She is vulnerable to the universe and this flow of healing is wrapped all around her. It is time for you to embrace this. Surrender. Surrender to the love and compassion within you. Those pieces of you that you have locked away, that is where your leadership is. That is where your treasure is. Those pieces in you will allow you to step forward into the role of leader, into the emperor position of leadership and knowledge. And I know that it's difficult. And there are opportunities offered to you all the time to embrace this, to expand this, to dig into this, but you tend to reject them. You tend to kind of go, no, I'm happy with what I have right now. And even though you're not happy, and even though you will literally say, I'm not happy, when you're presented with an opportunity to change, you reject it. And usually the reason is because change does not come in a Mercedes Benz. Change does not come wrapped up in a beautiful bow. It comes with spikes. It comes with needles. It comes with pain. It comes wrapped in anger sometimes. That is where the change comes from. The change comes from within you. And the change comes from the opportunities that people around us are bringing us. But this Three of Wands, it's still talking about the opportunities that are coming to you. It's still talking about what is out there on the horizon for you and embracing all pieces of you, embracing that wholeness of life that only you have. That is your road to these new opportunities. That is the way that you get there. Self-awareness, self-knowledge, and loving yourself is the way that you can fully embrace and integrate that energy of the universe, that unconditional love energy of the universe with yourself, with the human that you are right now, moving you forward into this new age. You are beloved. You matter. You are loved.